Class in session, guys, dropping another video. Okay, so this one is how to get out of a rut. Are you in a rut? Are you stuck? Where you're like, I don't know how I got in this shit, man. I, I, I got I got to get out of this shit. I, I can't be dealing with this anymore, right? You're in a rut. You're stuck and you're just like, I don't know or I can't be asked, right? You know, the one thing that I have learned along this journey is at some stage, we're all going to be in a rut. The question is, how do we get out of the rut? Now, here's the thing I've learned. Momentum. Momentum. It is doing something for a period of time at a certain speed and with consistency, right? It will push you out of a rut. I'll give you an example. So, I was in a rut and I said, right, I'm going to do these YouTube videos, right? And when I first started doing these videos, I think it was Feb 2020 or beginning of March 2020. I can't remember. Just have a look and go through the videos. Um, I remember, you know, I started doing videos. I was doing them for like a couple of weeks. But then I remember a couple of weeks, I stopped doing the videos. It was like subconsciously, I started speaking myself out of doing what I said I was going to do. However, I made a decision that there needs to be a system in place for me to be able to do these videos, upload them and get them out there so everyone can basically benefit. So I had to devise a system in place for me to be like, all right, cool, I'm going to go and do this. And then I made a plan of how I was going to go about doing it. I said, right, I'm going to do five videos a week that are going to come out Monday to Friday, 7.30 p.m. UK time. I'm going to record them all one day, upload them, and then schedule them to come out on different days. What does that do? It leverages my time and I don't need to think about when it comes out because it's already been scheduled, right? Now, I have set up a system. See, this is the lesson I'm getting across to you guys is setting up a system of how you're going to do it, when you're going to do it and sticking with doing it. And here I am now. I've been very consistent with what I'm doing. And it's getting me out of a rut because I'm enjoying the process of doing it. See, an easy way of getting out of a rut, guys, is diverting your attention to something completely different. Diverting your attention to something you love doing, something you're passionate about, and then getting on with that and falling in love with doing it and enjoying the process of getting it done. This is the way you get out of ruts. So when you divert your attention from something that's negative and causing you to feel bad in the first place, and then you're focusing that att attention on something you enjoy doing, you're not giving this thing over here any more energy anymore. You are focusing on this area. Even if it's only like an hour or whatever, you're still giving some attention to this thing over here. Until eventually, this thing over here eventually grows bigger than this thing over here. And then next thing you know, this thing over here disintegrates and you ain't got to think about that anymore. Because you're full time over here enjoying yourself. This, this It's the same thing for like people in the arts or musicians or whatever. You may be working in a full time job and you're like, you're in a rut, right? I'm an artist. I shouldn't be here. But I'm being here to meet my basic needs. Okay, well, what are you doing with the rest of the hours? What are you doing? Are you writing that song? Are you writing that script? You know, are you doing something about it? Right? See, this is how you get out of the rut. This is how you get out of the situation. Allocating time 
to put on to the thing you said that you want to be full time. The thing that you want to do. And then you'll find yourself out of a rut. Trust the universe with its divine timing. As long as some action is going on over here, it's going to get you out of that rut. So why are you in the rut? How are you going to get out? You need to, you know, think, you know, what is it you want to do? And start focusing your time and energy onto that thing. Even if it's one hour a day. It's going to eventually get you out of that rut. See, guys, it's not about... See, there's no excuses no more, guys. I mean, we got we got the internet here now. It's like me learning um, trading in the financial markets, right? I was in a financial rut. I'm sure most of you can agree, you know, you might be in a financial rut. Always broke or, you know, you just don't seem to have enough money. How do you get out of that rut? Personal development. Because you're only doing in life now what you currently know in regards to your knowledge base. Well, here's where you get new skills. You know, how does my mind work? How do I think? How can I think differently? You know, feeling better. You know, you can train yourself to feel more better. You know, there are processes for that. I'll say, Abraham Hicks, go YouTube that. And there is, you were meant to hear that today, by the way. Abraham Hicks, YouTube that, and you know, I'm, that's all I'm going to say, okay? So, in regards to the financial rut, there are going to be beliefs you will need to liberate yourself from, and learning a skill of how to actually multiply this money. How can we get this money moving, and doing something differently with it? See, it's not that you don't have enough. It's the fact that you don't know what to do with what you currently have. And I can show you the power of 10 pence, but I will leave that for another video. But it all comes down to fun and allocating your time and prioritizing over that thing that's in the rut. Because I know what it's like to be in a rut, guys. I was in a rut for three years until I started doing three new things differently and being consistent with it. And guess what? I'm falling in love with these things. And I know at the right time, things will take off where I won't be in that rut anymore. And this bad boy right here, the whole world's gonna know it. And you heard it from me today. So find what you love, allocate time to it. Make sure you feel good, be consistent with it. Keep it moving. And eventually you will be out of that rut. This is Benton Vision dropping you a new video. Comment, like, subscribe, tap the bell button for more notifications. Holler back.